It is time to check the viewer's voice. Garland police today released their arrest affidavit for a man charged with a washing machine murder of his young son, even though they later dropped the charges and released Joseph Blocker from jail. The investigator said that they believe the four year old boy was inside the front loading washing machine for a full cycle. D.I. writes front loader washing machines will not turn on until the door is closed and then turned on. The buttons for these types of washing of machines are way up on top. Doesn't sound like negligent death. Next, we did a story on the budget Congress approved over the weekend, including money to fight Ebola and a plan that uh, took some extra precautions because, excuse me, a plane that took some extra precautions because of a passenger that had been thought to be exposed to Ebola. Charlotte from Mesquite wrote in, I'm so tired of hearing and seeing the Ebola alert blue band when there isn't even one person in the USA who has Ebola. It's like you're trying to whip people into another frenzy. I think she's talking about a little icon on the screen because a little box, Charlotte, on the screen says Ebola alert. We're, I promise you, you are not whipping people into another frenzy. Or, or any kind of frenzy. Finally, Cowboys running back DeMarco Murray broke his left hand last night and was scheduled to have surgery today. Coach Jason Garrett says Murray has a chance to play this Sunday. Patrick here is optimistic either way. That's strange for the voice, isn't it? Yes. As long as the line keeps doing what they do, the other two backs should be good enough to get us through. All right. Let me hear from you at 214-720-3103 or send an email. Click about us, then contact us at myfoxdfw.com.